Hi, this is Michael Walters with the Stern team at Keller Williams. And my goal is to keep you educated about all things real estate so you have the ability to make great decisions when it comes to your own home selling, buying, and investing goals. Today, we're gonna to talk about the four key trends that buyers and sellers should watch for in 2019. If your dreams include buying your own home, now is the time to keep an eye on the ever-changing tides of the housing market. Markets are like the weather. You can't entirely predict how they will act, but you can get a sense of the forces that will push things in one direction or another. The Realtor.com economic research team analyzed a wealth of housing data to come up with a forecast of what 2019 might hold for home buyers and sellers. And it looks like both groups are going to be facing some challenges. One, we'll have more homes um, for sale, especially luxury ones. We've been chronicling super tight inventory of homes for sales for years now. Yet homes have been hitting the market, but not enough to keep up with the demand. Nationwide inventory actually hit the lowest level in recorded history last winter, but this year has finally started to recover. We're expected to see the inventory growth continue into next year, but not as a, at a blockbuster rate, in fact, less than 7%. While this is welcome news for buyers who have been sidelined, sellers must confront a new reality. Although next year's inventory growth is expected to be modest nationwide, Pricier markets will tell a different story. In these markets, uh, which typically have strong economies, most of the expected inventory growth will come from luxury homes. Number two, uh, affording a home will remain tough. It's, it's no secret that home sellers have been sitting pretty for the past several years, but is the tide about to change in the buyer's favor? Well, in some ways, yes, because life is going to be easier uh, for the home buyers. In fact, they're gonna have more options but life is also going to be more difficult for home buyers because we can expect mortgage rates to continue to increase and we can expect home prices to continue to increase. So the pinch that they're feeling from affordability is going to continue to be a pain point. Number three, millennials will still dominate home buying. Just a few years ago, millennials were the new kids on the block, just barely old enough to buy their own homes. Now they're the biggest generational group of home buyers, accounting for 45% of mortgages compared with 17% for baby boomers and 37% for Gen Xers. Some of them are even moving up from their starter homes. As we mentioned, things will be tough for those first time home buyers, but the slightly older move up buyers will reap the benefits of both their home equity and the increased choices in the market. I hope this has been useful information for you. Please give us a call or send us an email if you have any real estate questions or needs. Also, you're able to get your free instant market evaluation on this site by clicking the home evaluation tab uh, or click on the home search tab to search real properties uh, real time for all brokerages along the Wasatch Front.